Welcome back. In this edition of How to Use Practice Score, I want to cover three uh, points with you. How you might send an email to everybody that's registered for your upcoming match, or how to send a email just to certain people in your match, a particular squad, let's say, and how to print a hard copy a piece of paper that has everybody that's signed up for your match. Uh, let's assume two things. One, that you're already signed up and have your own account here on Practice Score. Number two, your administrator, your club uh, guru for computers, uh, systems administrator, whatever, uh, needs to have you signed up uh, to administer a particular match. When that happens, and here's your typical dashboard uh, for everybody, uh, this tab will appear. You want to click on this because now you're a match director, someone who can send emails and do things uh, relative to the squad assignments and uh, change things administratively in practice score for a particular match. So let's click on this tab. And first we're going to show you an example how to email uh, whatever it is you might want to send to everybody that's currently signed up for your match. So I'm going to pick a particular match here that's uh, upcoming right away. I'll go over here and select uh, this one. You may have more or less than what I have. And that gets you to this page, the dashboard for a particular match for a particular club. You'll want to scroll down a little bit here. I'll just scroll. You can, of course, stop the video anytime you want. And you want to go over here to this blue manage button for the uh, particular match for the particular date in question. And when you uh, just uh, touch or hover over this uh, blue manage button, you'll notice uh, you get several drop downs. In this case, we're looking for the second one, approve and slash view shooters. Now, do you notice how it disappears? Well, click on the blue manage button and then it freezes. That allows you to very easily get down to approve slash view shooters. Click on that. Text. And then you have everybody listed that's going to be participating in your forthcoming match for the date in question. Over here on the right, you can see email shooters. I'll click on that text. And up pops probably a pretty familiar format uh, where you fill in the blanks, uh, change the email address as necessary, select who it needs to go to, such as all match shooters all the way down to the staff that you have. If you need to copy somebody uh, that's not currently shooting in the match, uh, click the Add Recipients button. Here's your subject line. Uh, copy and paste or originally type in the text. And then down here at the bottom, you've got to send email and everybody in the match uh, gets the same message. Uh, this is going to be particularly useful for our club that's located in north central Texas, where we have a lot of uh, bad weather. Mostly uh, rainstorms come in and ruins the uh, match for the weekend. So this would be nice to send out the afternoon of, the evening of uh, the match. That way all the people know that whether the match is going to be held or postponed or changes in timing. Uh, whatever is necessary to send everybody uh, a uh, email that's registered in the match. Okay, once you've got that done, sent to everybody in the match, maybe you just want to send something to uh, a particular squad, a limited number of people. So I'm going to go up here to my browser and I'm going to hit the uh, back button and that'll take me back one step. I'm hitting the browser back button and it takes me back to uh, our blue manage page again here or blue manage button. I'll click on that again. In this case, I'm going to go down to manage squatting. I'll click on that. And here's everybody that's currently signed up for everybody in their particular squad. So let's say I needed to uh, send a message to uh, squad one. Maybe I've decided I have some reason to believe I need only three squads rather than uh, one. I could click on the little email icon here. Again, change the uh, from as necessary. Click on uh, whatever you want to do here in squad one. Uh, subject line, uh, maybe something like, hey, would you please move yourself from squad one to one of the other squads because we're not going to have a squad one. So that's how you would uh, email uh, everybody in a given squad rather than the entire uh, registered match uh, shooters. I hit the back button again if you didn't catch that. And let's say for some reason you needed to print 
the old-fashioned hard copy, as they say, everybody that's currently signed up because you need to make a paper copy because administratively it just helps you do what you need to do. If you'll notice over here under the big word squatting, we have a fast and a slow way. Well, we just want to do it a fast way because I just simply want to print a copy of everybody that's signed up uh, for my match. I'll click on the text print squads. And here it appears, everybody that signed up, you can see all the empties and everybody that is signed up. Maybe you want to do some uh, thinking about moving people around or some other notes uh, relative to having a piece of paper in your hand to administratively uh, run the match. So I hope that helps you out. You've got a way to send everybody an email message, just the people in a given squad, and also how to print a piece of paper with everybody in your match. Hope that's helpful. I'll be making some other videos on some other things you can do in practice score. Thanks for watching.